Breaking news, my wonderful people. See what Arewa are asking Buhari, that before Buhari releases on the canal, they want this to be done. Okay, before Buhari can release on the canal, Buhari must do this for them. And this is causing serious reactions. Initially, when Igbo leaders went to Buhari, he said he cannot release on the canal. The court should decide on the canal's future. Well, the court has decided his future. The court said the guy is discharged. But guess what? Buhari's government say no. They will not release him. And they did not quite say why they will not release him. Now we are seeing that uh, Unandi Kanu is not just uh, a, a, an issue for political settlement. Even Arewa has an interest in the matter. They said for Buhari to release Unandi Kanu, eh? for Buhari to release Unandi Kanu, that Buhari must, you know, uh, the, the, you know, the North must be compensated as a result of Northerners that were killed, you know, in, in, in the Southeast. You see, if we, we, we will demand compensation from for Northerners killed if Unandi Kanu is released. So this is what they are saying. They don't want him to be released. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like or share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. The Arewa Youth Conservative Forum, AYCF, has highlighted its next line of action. If Unandi Kanu leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, is released. AYCF warned that if its, if its demand for compensation for the northern northerners killed and their properties destroyed in the southeast is not met, Unandi Kano will not be released. Yari Shatima, the national president of AYCF, said releasing Unandi Kano will show a sign of weakness on the part of Buhari's government. Shatima noted that releasing IPOB leader would could interpret can be interpreted to mean that the government was afraid of him and security agencies were overwhelmed. He stressed that Kano's case would be used as a reference point to as a reference point for criminals and for crime committed in the future if released. According to Shetima, release Unandi Kano because the Nigerian government is afraid of him, release him because Nigerian securities are overwhelmed of his crime and people being killed in the northeast, in the southeast, would we will have to get compensation. Any legal business and anything being done, we will have to get compensation on this matter. The law must take its full course as they go round. We must know what we want and we must get it accordingly. If not, there will be a problem. It will, there will be a serious problem if Unandi Kano is released and the law and there is no compensation for those who have been whose lives has been taken. If Unandi Kano is not released, if Unandi Kano is released without any form of compensation, then there will be serious issues. We will not allow that to happen. So this is what is happening right now, my people. This is what is going on, and you can see for yourself that Nigerians, it's up to you and I, every one of us, okay? We must work at it and ensure that at the end of the day, Nigeria becomes a better place. Look at what is being said. Look at what is being dispensed at this point in time. He said if the release on the canal is like, you know, you're daring somebody, saying don't release him because of this. But Yerim, I want to really look at it. What is the crime of Onandi Kano? They don't know they cannot ask anybody to commit any those who committed crime committed it because they wanted to commit a crime. Okay, they just use Unandi Kano as, as their basis to say whatever they want to do. It's not Unandi Kano was not the it's not the reason why they committed whatever crime they committed. And Buhari himself, what sort of a president is this? You told Igbo leaders that Unandi, releasing Unandi Kano is, is, is off your hand. That, but yet, you are making way, okay, for Fulani headsmen. You are doing everything for them. Not, not just Fulani headsmen, uh, you know, terrorists and those who are committing real crime in the country. You are allowing them go scot-free. Yet, you hold on and the canoe. Why are you holding him? What crime has he committed? Even the, even the, the uh, Shetima himself, the Yarima, excuse me, the Yarima himself, can he really tell Nigerians the crime on and the canoe has committed? What's the main crime? What what exactly did he do? 
what is it now in the canoe's main crime that we almost know and pay attention to and ensure that you know we know exactly what's going on what is his main crime what is the main crime for which he's being held the this judiciary system has said release him yet the government still holds him down and you tell me that everything is working well and you tell me that things are all right is that not oppression the same you told them then that you will not release on the canoe unless you know the court the court, the court should decide his faith the court has looked at the matter and has decided his faith and is saying, you know, we will not, uh, uh, Unandi Kanu can be freed. And yet, you guys are holding on to him. Does it make sense? Does it make sense? Is that, if that's not, uh, provoc if that's not provocative, I don't know what else is. These are the very people who are destroying the very fabric of this nation. You hold Unandi Kanu and you expect those who, you know, you, you hold somebody else's child while your own child is going scot free. And you expect everybody to be smiling with you and laughing with you. Does it make sense? Just between you and I, does it make sense? Is that not wickedness? Well, that's what we are experiencing. That's exactly what we are experiencing. And everybody's quiet. Everybody's quiet and looking at what is going on. Everybody's just quiet. Allowing these people and these things to continue. You see? What exactly do now the canoe do? Then now, now, northern youth are saying, ah, eh, if they release now the canoe, ah, there will be issues or... Eh, we will, we, will, we will get this, we will get that. What exactly is this crime? What exactly? The young man is saying, if you don't want us to be part of your government, there's no problem. Let us go. Let us leave Nigeria for you. You will not let him go, and yet you will hold him down, and you accuse him of both the crime he committed and the crime he did not commit. Because Nigerian government has not really said on the Kano's crime. Or, do you know that? What exactly has been said that Unandi Kanu did? Maybe I missed that point. What exactly was this crime? What, what exactly did he do? What is, I want to know that very thing he did for which he must, be, he, must be, he must face justice and get judgment. If you ask them, they may not be able to tell you. Eh, he made some people to do this. He made them to do Did he cost them? Did he hold their hands? Are they not adults? Eh? Adults, when you make a decision, are you not responsible for the, for, the, for, the, for the decision you have made? So who are you leaving there? Who are you holding? Who are you, who are you expecting? We'll be, we, we will be the one. My dear, please leave us a comment. Don't forget to like or share, subscribe. Click on the notification button. God bless. Have a lovely and a fantastic day. From us, it's bye for now. Remember, you have a voice.